everybody, what's going on? Vinny here from Nerd Talk, and today we are looking at a awesome launcher that I have found on the Play Store. It's called Zen Launcher. Now, this launcher actually isn't very popular just yet. I think it's about to be because this is an incredible launcher. So, let's take a look here. So, basically, right on the front home page here, we have a pretty simplistic look with kind of smaller icons. Uh, you have this nice little icon pack that comes with it. It looks pretty clean. You have this cool clock that comes with it. That shows you, you know, the time, the date, the weather, and your current city by GPS. Uh, so if you swap off to the left, you have just kind of a widget page. I have Google Now just set up there, and that is it. You also have a Google search down at the bottom. And then if you swipe off to the right, this is where all your apps are. So it'll show you what you may like, and then your most used apps here. You also have some quick settings right here. So you have brightness, you have sound, Wi-Fi, data, and flashlight connectivity there. If you swipe from this page over, you go into the app drawer. And this is just a, a full vertical list, sorted alphabetically. Very nice. Uh, you can jump to letters touching on the side here on the edge and then you can force you can control it by just scrolling like this as well very very nice launcher I really enjoy it so far it's so different from other things that you know has all this customization stuff it's very different so we can go into the settings real quick you just hold down on the screen we can go into Zen settings and you can set it as your default launcher, which I haven't done yet because I'm just not quite sure about it yet. I really love Nova, but this is starting to win me over. You also have uh, things like this. You can show the, show the search bar. You can show the widget page, which I'm, of course, going to keep. You can show the maybe you like. I'm going to keep that because, who knows, maybe I'll find some cool apps through that, and it's not like it's taking up space anywhere. You can also change your search engine and then you can go to about and they'll tell you you know their email address and stuff like that you can rate the app through there as well uh, some other stuff when you hold down of course you can change the wallpaper you can add widgets so nice. very fun guys I really re highly recommend checking it out it's so different that you might just fall in love with it I'm starting to really like it uh, take some getting used to because it is very different uh, but really I mean so much that you, you will love it, trust me, you'll just love it. And that is how you add stuff to the home screen, you don't drag and drop, you hold down on it and then you hit home screen and then it'll successfully move to the home screen right there. So anyways guys, thank you so much for watching, hope you enjoyed, if you did give this video a thumbs up if you would please and don't forget to subscribe, also don't forget to like us on Facebook and follow me on Twitter guys, see you all in the next one.